Debbie Birch, and I'm with the Queen Anne's County Office of Tourism, and I'm here today to talk about an exciting upcoming event, October 11th. It's the ninth annual Taste of Kent Narrows, held at the Chesapeake Heritage and Vis Visitor Center right on the Kent Narrows. And here to tell us more about it is Joe Pomerantz, and are you chair of the event this year? Uh, I've been chair of the event probably the last four or five <laughs> years. Took <laughs> over from Pat Warren's. Okay. Pat had done it for us for years, and uh, so I've assumed that post. And uh, she continues to serve on our committee as awesome. well as uh, several others um, and we have had a successful show uh, for I guess the eight prior years. We're right, now on the right. ninth annual. That's right, that's right. So tell people who aren't familiar about this what it is. It's called the Taste of Kent Narrows, so I'm thinking there's food involved. There is food. It's all food. It's not just seafood. It's all the uh, restaurants and uh, food and taste that you might encounter down at the Kent Narrows okay. and just beyond the Kent Narrows. Uh, Kent Island and the Graysonville area, just around that uh, quadrant, uh, we've got 12 restaurants that are going to be taking part. Okay. Um, we may even have more by the time of the show. Right okay. now we have 12 restaurants. and So people purchase a ticket and then they come in and they just basically graze from the whole time. Right. Not only graze, <laughs> uh, they get to walk around and visit with our vendors. We have uh, okay. bands that are on site. We have Divide and Conga, Jonathan Veers, and we also have, uh, that is going to be Out of the Blue. Uh, okay. The third band that we're going to have this year. Wonderful. So we have food, music, vendors, um, and is this just for adults or is it a family event? It's totally a family event. We've okay. got uh, kids' activities uh, throughout the day, uh, going from 12 to 4, and then 5, we go till 5 with the music. So okay. The serving oh, nice. stops at 4, but we have an extra hour with the music and, and activities winding down. Okay, okay. And, um, it's a rain or shine event, correct? It is, yes. We've had some uh, issues in the past where it's been almost rain. Uh, even when we did have some rain, it still right. went on and it wasn't bad. So right. uh, we look forward to rain or shine. Uh, and it's uh, a terrific time when people can come in with their families, put their chairs down, sit for the afternoon, or like I said, visit the vendors right. and other activities that we have on site. So I have to ask, tell me about Chester and Esther. Um, I know you have these two crabs who do something special at the at the event. Yes, Chester and Esther, uh, we take two crabs and we have a ramp that they climb up. Uh, they are going to exit into the bay, into okay. the narrows. Ah, there we um, go. The first one that goes in, either Chester, the male, or Esther, the female, uh, depending on which one goes to the water first, will tell us quite accurately <laughs> Whether we're going to have an early fall <laughs> or an early winter. Okay. Uh, might even tell us if we're going to have a late fall or a late winter. Okay. Okay. I'm not sure which, but, <laughs> but it's, it's, fun to, it's, it's fun to play yeah. the crabs. <laughs> no, I, I like that. Play the crabs. There that's we right, go. That's yep. right. So that's that's something else. It's fun for the kids to watch them go off and into the water. So they're not being harmed or anything. No, no. We don't steam them afterward. I would, yeah, that's they're, what I was They're free say. to go. They're not part of the tasting. And tickets are available online and then different places around the Narrows area and the area. I know we have a list that's up on the um, screen. Right. So they can just come in and do that. And then if they want more information, they can go to the website. Tasteofthekentnarrows.org. Um, okay. And... Anything else that we should know about the event? I'm trying to think. I, it's a it's a wonderful event. It's a lots lots and lots of fun. And you know, I've been a few times, and um, you know, it's it's a nice crowd, and it's just a really pleasant day. Yes, it's going to be down at the Heritage and Visitor Center, right there at the Kent Narrows. Right. And uh, uh, the terrific venue right there at the uh, Narrows with the water. Uh, the surrounding park, Ferry Point Park, just to the north of us, yep. and the, uh, the county building itself. It's got some nice displays inside. We've got the museum. We've also got the, um, the uh, I guess it's the west room or the... Uh, the eastern the eastern bay room and the Chester River room. Correct. Yeah, I have to right. think. The two one rooms. to the north, one to the south. Exactly. Uh, we have displays in there. Right. Uh, we also have the brochures for all the different county activities and uh, promotions in that building. And um, one last thing, parking, uh, because people might be thinking, well, if it's on the grounds of the visitor center, where are people going to park? Tell us about how, how you move people around. Well, what we've got down Piney Narrows Road is where people will be walking, um, f traveling from the old factory stores. Uh, okay. Thankfully, Mr. Jamal um, allows us to go ahead and park in his facility down at the factory stores. The Cub Scouts uh, pack 496, always uh, runs our parking. Okay, uh, they are the parking pros. operation down there. <laughs> so you'll have uh, parents and cubs down there parking Excellent. the cars. 
uh, free parking, um, okay. and they will then direct people up the road. And then we also have handicap parking that's next door do to you, the Heritage Are you going to be running the um, tractors back and forth, do you know, this year? I know you've done that in the past. That yes, that's our plan. People um, movers. Correct. Yeah, we'll have a plan for um, moving people up and okay. down. If they're not walking, they can hitch a ride on the, on the tractor. Okay, so there's no excuse for not coming then. That's right. That's nope. right. All right. Well, then come out. It's Saturday, October 11th. It's noon to 5. The 4, the four o'clock, the food stops being served, but the music continues till 5. So come out. Go to the website if you want more information. And thank you so much for coming. Oh, you're welcome. I'll make one more plug. Uh, okay. The, the pricing on the tickets, $30 mm -hmm. is a pre-event uh, price. You can get that at the locations that uh, are selling the tickets. Uh-huh. Uh, and then $35 is at the door. And then okay. there is a VIP ticket that en oh, that's en right. enables you to um, take part in some uh, additional uh, features. And that's um, new this year, right? That's right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, one's an early entry. Instead of the 12 o'clock entry, you're in there at 1130 and you can get set up and, and start looking around Snack and get the first and tasting. Right. That's right. Okay. So. Well, thank you so much. My pleasure, Debbie.